Hello guys, what's up? So today in this video, I will talk about some of the fixes to the issues which are currently happening in the game Marvel Spider-Man Remastered for PC. Even though this is the best PlayStation port to PC, but still there are some issues which needs to be fixed. And these are the list of issues and fixes which I'm going to talk about in this video. The first is the crash fix. The third is the high CPU usage fix. The third is the shuttering and lag fix. The fourth is the Windows version error fix. And the fifth and the last is the news on any updated patch fix which could be coming in from PlayStation. So let's get started. Firstly, the precondition, you must have an updated graphics driver, AMD or NVIDIA, you must have and must have an updated driver. For NVIDIA, the updated driver version is 516.94. You must have this driver before playing this game. Now, let's start the first issue and fix. The first issue is the crash issue, which is currently happening in all the gamers. And it has been seen that disable full screen optimization is left unchecked. So if you want to fix your crash issue, make sure that you check this box and disable full screen optimization and restart your game. Hopefully you would be playing and getting a smoother experience in your game. Now moving on to the next issue and fix, which is the high CPU usage fix. Currently gamers having RTX on option in their graphics card or RTX enabled graphics card. They're facing a very interesting issue is that their CPU usage is increasing and and also another factor is that for people who do not have RTX, for them also there are instances when the CPU usage is increasing. So to fix this, the workaround which is going around is that you have to ensure that your dedicated GPU is being utilized instead of the integrated one. Now what is the integrated one? Your Intel i3, i7 processor. Make sure your game and programs knows that they have to use the Nvidia or the AMD graphics card instead of your i3 processor. For that, what you have to do, you have to open NVIDIA control panel, then navigate to 3D settings, and then manage 3D settings, open the tab proper setting, and choose a Spider-Man remaster program, and then select the preferred graphics processor for this program from the second dropdown, and then NVIDIA GPU should show as high performance NVIDIA processor. Save the changes, restart the game. This will make sure that your load from CPU is distributed to your graphics card to your dedicated GPU so that your CPU usage is decreases and your game runs smoothly. Make sure to restart your game and then hopefully you will be getting a smoother experience. Now moving on to the next thing which is shuttering and lag fix. Now before you launch the game make sure that all other programs are closed. For that you have to go to task manager and, and any other task like Google Chrome, Xbox, make sure all that all these tasks are closed because all your resources from your system should be utilized for the game to get to get a smoother experience especially for people playing this game on lower end system so make sure you close all the application and processes which are currently running on the system so that your game runs again smoothly now moving on to the next thing which is windows version error fix now this is again a very interesting issue which is coming in is that for gamers who are having Windows 11 and when they're running the game, what is happening is that the game Marvel Spider-Man Remastered is using DirectX Agility SDK which requires Windows 10 version 9109, build 18363 or newer version. So some kind of confusion is coming in in the program and in the game because the program is not understanding that the game is running on Windows 11 and it is looking for a Windows 10 version. DirectX Agility SDK. So for that, what you have to do, you have to make sure that you are not running this game in the compatibility mode. Make sure that the compatibility mode is left unchecked so that your program or this game is not getting confused that it is running on Windows 11 or Windows 10. So make sure you do that. And the last thing, which is news on updated patch fix. Currently, the patch fix which is going to come in is for high-end CPU usage because the RTS enabled graphics card are having a are having problem in which CPU usage is increasing. So the PlayStation is currently working on that updated, updated fix. And considering the other patch fixes, it may take time, maybe a couple of weeks, two, three weeks of time for other, other issues to be fixed, like the crash fix, shuttering. If gamers are frequently getting this issue and this number of gamers, the number of ga gamers getting these issues increases, then definitely the updated patch fix could be coming very soon. So this was the update regarding and issues and fixes regarding Marvel Spider-Man Remastered, which is by far the best PC port after God of War. God of War was also very smooth, but it had one or two issues. Similarly with Marvel Spider-Man Remastered, it is also having some issues, but this is the best PC port. So hopefully you like this video. Our next target is 10K subscribers. So if you haven't subscribed my channel, kindly subscribe it. And let's see you on the, and, and let's see you on another video. Bye-bye. Take care.
keep supporting keep loving and always always keep gaming